First, you will name your guest group with the preferred name. For example, your guest group can be Cindy Jones or Jones Family. Here you can add contact and guest details. I will add some basic info here. Next, you can enter the address information. Again, I will enter some basic info here. Next are seating preferences. Primary groups are necessary and social groups are important. Creating a social group will save you a lot of time when assigning seating and seating arrangement. A social group can be named co-workers, cousins, or high school friends, for example. Okay, next. You can always go back to the guest list and click in an empty area to update information. You can even check the RSVP box when a guest confirms their plans to attend. You can click guest list to see all of your guest groups, RSVP, and seating information compiled together. Remember to save your project often to avoid losing your work. Seating arrangement has many more features. Make sure to check out our website for more information. Also, the best way to learn is opening and exploring seating arrangement. Thanks for watching.